black beauty with the perfect one here we go be careful when throwing that cigarette down dot dot them trees may get to burning like y'all are <laughs> oh boy let's view the replies even nadir had to love this one Hey there, welcome back to Stories from the Internet. I'm Monty and I'm your host, and this is another El Shami video. It seems Nether dropped his video from Lake Fortune, which is in Chelsea, Quebec, where Foodie Beauty shot her video on the 4th of October. His video dropped about 13 hours ago, as of the time of this recording. And it was very scenic i could say that yeah it's scenic but it's more filler than anything else he didn't really talk much he gave us a lot of views of the scenery because that area is beautiful it does have ski slopes and it is pretty close to gatineau quebec just maybe a 30 45 minute drive and then you're there so for the views for the amenities, for the park, for the ski slopes, it is something. So let's get into that video and talk about it some more. Look at this. This tree looks like a thousand years old. One of them. <laughs> like the views is awesome. The colors is awesome, but this is more filler than anything else. But the man is still getting views, I'll just say that. Whatever he puts out, he gets the views. His like-dislike ratio is now very similar to Foodie Beauty though. And a lot of Quebec, I must say, when you go to the outskirts out of the cities, is just like this. It's beautiful. This is a place a lot of people go to. If you do live in Gatineau or Ottawa, just across the bridge, you drive for less than an hour, then you're there. Wow. You can hike, you can walk, you can go to the park, you can ski, like I said. Pretty much has everything. Area. Yeah, that is beautiful. Look at that. Is that beautiful? Yeah, but I gotta say this. I can't blame the guy. This is the same guy a couple days ago couldn't get his camera to work on the, his first live stream. So I can't blame the guy to not really put together a quality video like he doesn't know that much about youtube he doesn't know that much about technology this is a guy who will be considered a technology immigrant because that's what they call people who are very unfamiliar who didn't grow up with technology But then again, Becky, Becky's video is kind of like the same where she just, you know, clips random stuff together, puts it together, puts out a video and still get the views. At the end of the day, as long as you can get the views with a good video or a shitty video, does it really matter? Not really, but quality is a better than quantity, right, folks? Because quality, quality videos, I should say, will have you stay will have you want to watch more that's beautiful dude. like his cooking is good but his attitude is a trash and i wonder if he's burning right now is he it makes me wonder is this man currently burning in the trunk at this moment hi hi so there we go foodie beauty 
man is getting paid a good chunk of money just for fillers as i've said fillers all around and i'm sure it was quite a workout the trails are beautiful there by the way once again lake fortune or should i say lac fortune in chelsea quebec if you want to know where this is but let's skip forward a little bit you know more views more fillers as i've said more fillers more fillers and more fillers but you know what is actually really good at the comment section so maybe we should get into that right now so let's take a look at the beautiful comment section that is filled with hilarity slight jabs shade direct and indirect at foodie beauty as well as nadir el shami so let's pause this video put the browser on and let's get into it so where shall i start oh boy so sarah says so you guys drove together to then film separate and act like you weren't together got it laughing out loud five replies he said beep beep i don't get that but okay Harry.i I says, aren't we lucky living in Canada, free healthcare? Where else can you mix your speed ball with free penicillin, smoke it on tinfoil, then take a leisurely walk in the woods with a big fat joint as a chaser? Greatest country in the world. Beautiful scenery, by the way. Okay, fear enough. Fear enough. We all juggle knives when foodie beauty finds out there is no elevator to go back up dot 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 phoenix says what's next for the planned storyline nads guess nads is now a double entendre if you know what i mean nads as in go nads as in the testicles is Chantel going to get pregnant despite having a hysterectomy can't wait for the next installment whatever you gotta do for the money hmm shade 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 black beauty with the perfect one here we go be careful when throwing that cigarette down dot dot them trees may get to burning like y'all are <laughs> oh boy let's view the replies even nadir had to love this one lorna says like he really needs another criminal charge yes it is criminal to do that cherry oh shit you win best comment for sure definitely even dare is cracking up with the laughing emojis come on that was beautiful manager of three monsters i assume this gentle relaxing walk was prairie to green golf ball gonorrhea gate <laughs> i'm sure it was because it would hurt right if your gonads are swollen you know, they're bouncing around in the box of briefs, depending on how loose or tight your underwear are. Because, you know, there's briefs, there's boxers, and then there's boxer briefs. Like, yeah, boxers can be very loose. Boxer briefs are a little bit snug. You know, depends how tightly wrapped and encased they are in that underwear. Blair Fisk says, how ironic that Chantel calls you an ads. Like I said, double entendre, right? Double entendre. Miranda, why does everyone say she's a huge liar and you can't believe a word she says? But any negative words said about Nadir are believed instantly. It's really weird. Well, they can have a point there. Like he really should kind of say his piece. But then I can totally understand why he's not saying his piece because it kind of adds to the element of mystery it kind of adds to the story some people can say kind of takes away from the story but kind of adds to the story as in we haven't heard from him yet he's really just speaking through actions rather than words plus you know it's really good when you're in the pen when you're in the correctional facility to mind your own business shut your mouth mind your own business as they would say Schmoody boop says you've heard of benny and the jets get ready for chinny and the clap yikes anyone green with envy over the epic love story yikes shade 
Shade, 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 shade. Samantha and Galvan says, if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Boy, you guys are funny yet savage in these comments. Anja says, twerking during a video. Oh my God, guys, what's that clapping sound? I don't know where that's coming from. <laughs> boy 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 fairy says this is chantel's second channel does nads reply i guess he does and he says a big fat no debbie nader side p says will their std have its own channel do you think yes maybe maybe so a third channel for the green gonorrhea oh boy would you watch that i would watch that i don't know anyways i guess that is it for the comments that really stick out there is a lot of them a lot a lot a lot of them one after the other hundreds and hundreds of comments as soon okay let's check this out how many views does this video have to close this up at this time of this recording 8461 views that's a good chunk of change to really be honest with you, because I'm saying his CPM is about eight to sixteen dollars, maybe a little bit more, eight to seventeen. He's already monetized. His like ratio is two seventy six to seven seventy. Uh, so we got like a one to three ratio going on there. And the man is getting paid through the converse. controversy is what I should be saying. So at the end of the day, um, does it matter if you're liked or disliked? For some people, it does. For others, it doesn't because at the end of the day, he's there to make videos and get paid. Whatever else is just a secondary consequence and those consequences might be mute points. Anyways, this is going to be it for me. Hope you fully you like this video. And if you do, well, leave a comment and leave a like. And that will be it for me. So subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Turn on your notification bell if you haven't turned on your notification bell. Leave a comment as I've just said. And I will see you later. Take care.